Today, I'm gonna show you how to factory reset your Apple Silicon Mac. Now that's M1, M2, or M3 using macOS recovery. First, you're gonna go into system settings and you're gonna sign out of your Apple ID and find my. Once you've done that, you can go up to the Apple logo in the upper left and hit shutdown. You give that a minute to turn off. Then all we're gonna need to do is hold down the power button until we see loading startup options. Continue holding for startup options loading startup options you can now release the power button once we get here you're gonna see your macintosh hd this will boot you back into your os but to factory reset we want to go to options continue and this is going to take us into recovery we are now going to go to disk utility to erase our internal ssd on this mac now that we're in disk utility we're going to click on our macintosh hd and we are going to hit erase. We're gonna name it Macintosh HD. The format has to be APFS or Apple File System. Once you have that selected, erase. To erase or delete volumes, you will need to fully erase this Mac. This will delete all media, data, and settings on all volumes on this Mac. An internet connection is required to reactivate this Mac and install Mac OS. Erase Mac, erase Mac and restart. Okay, now we need to activate, which means we have to connect to the internet. For this, I'm just gonna plug in my ethernet dongle real quick. We can now say your Mac is activated. Now we wanna click exit to recover. Now the Mac has successfully been erased. I also have a bootable copy of Mac OS Sonoma 14.1 on this external drive. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna plug that in now to reinstall our OS. If you don't have a bootable copy of Mac OS on an external drive like me, all you need to do is reinstall whatever version of mac os using this second option right here reinstall mac os in this case ventura but it can be big sur monterey ventura or sonoma but anyway we have it on external drive there will be a video coming out a week from the time of this video's release showing you how to create bootable mac os usb drives with monterey ventura and sonoma but for now you're going to select this option and reinstall mac os but for this video we're going to quit we need to restart to get back to the option where we can select our external drive. Now we should see install macOS Sonoma pop up here shortly. There it is. It's reading it off my external drive. Continue. English. Here we go. macOS Sonoma. To set up installation of macOS Sonoma, click continue. Agree. We want this on Macintosh HD. Continue. And it's going to go ahead and write all the files for macOS Sonoma to the Macintosh HD. Once that's done, we'll be back. The Mac OS Sonoma install is just about to finish up here. When it does, the Mac should restart. The Mac is now restarting and it should bring us to the Sonoma setup screen. As you can see, we're now at the Sonoma setup screen. That's how you factory reset and reinstall Mac OS on your M1, M2, or M3 MacBook.